Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be another month of my Face Story unboxing. If you guys have not heard of Face Story, like I say in all of my other videos, they are a monthly subscription box in which you receive sheet masks, so basically skincare sheet masks. They do offer two different options on their website. One is a Forever Fresh bundle in which you get four different sheet masks. And then they also have the Seven Lux bundle, which is the one I always subscribe to, in which you get seven sheet masks. One of those is a hydrogel mask. Instead of that cotton material, one of the masks included in your seven masks is a gel-like consistency, which is kind of nice because it definitely feels a little bit more luxurious. If you guys are curious about what came in this month's face story, then just keep watching. I'm like just totally not digging this today. I was at work so I really didn't have any makeup on and then this arrived in the mail today and I was like okay I'm gonna toss some makeup on and just film and like my hair is just like out of control so let's see. Let's ignore all this and just focus on this. All right let's see what we have inside. Happy B-Day. It must be Face Stories. I think this might be their year anniversary. It says, can you believe Face Story is already turning one this month? It's been one heck of a ride and none of this could have been possible without each and every one of you subscribers support. We're so grateful to have every single one of you guys, whether you're a subscriber from day one or a subscriber who just recently discovered us. We could not have asked for better subscribers who love and appreciate what we do. So let's keep this party going with a freshly curated batch of sheet masks. So I actually have been subscribed to Face Story all but two, the first two months that they've been around and I really, really like it. But again, I really enjoy sheet masks. I have a huge collection and I just like seeing all the new ones that they send each month and it's nice to just keep the collection fresh. Sometimes you find ones that you love that you can then go onto their website and reorder. But I just love having sheet masks around so if it's been a long day I can just pop one on or if I'm doing chores I can pop one on while I'm vacuuming or cleaning the kitchen or whatever and feel like I'm pampering myself while also getting work done. Anyway, all right, like every month it comes with the sheet that describes each of the seven masks and cute this month. They also include, included this sticker sheet set which basically just has like cute little stickers on it. Looks like this. So that's really fun. This is something that like would be cute to put in a planner or anything like that. All right, you guys, so it looks like a fun array of masks this month. Every month I swear, like every mask I read off, I'm like, ooh, this one sounds like it's gonna be my favorite. <clears throat> so anyway, the first one is this guy right here. This is the Banana Milk Mask Pack. So this one has a milky essence that smells like banana milk. This sheet mask uses a thin and transparent cotton sheet that will comfortably stick onto your face to lock in moisture that is being provided by the super milky essence. So it sounds like this is a moisturizing mask. I do like to organize my masks. Maybe I'll show you guys my skincare drawer someday. Um, but I like to organize my masks by um, hydrating. Oh my gosh, hydrating brightening and then what is the freaking hydrating brightening firming i swear there's like one more in there i can't i can't think of it can't think of it cleansing no it's not a cleanse anyway doesn't matter since the winter months are upon us my hydrating stack of masks has definitely been dwindling so i'm excited to add add had. I'm excited to add another uh, hydrating mask to my collection. Next is this revitalizing jelly mask. Jelly pack. So this mask claims to revitalize and restore aging skin to bring back its youth. The dense jelly essence in this sheet mask makes sure that the product is not runny, making it extremely convenient to use during any time of the day. Ha! Huh, this could be one that I use while cleaning. This has ginseng root extract, avocado fruit extract, and hydrolyzed collagen extract to provide both skin elasticity and vitality. I absolutely love when masks or anything in skincare has collagen in it because that helps to keep your skin nice and, nice and youthful. So excited for this one. Next one has super pretty packaging. This is the Merengue Cloud Mask. Hi. On a side note, I have on the MAC liquid lipstick and high drama, one of their like original formulas. And like I forgot how disgustingly drying this formula is. Like 
I'm literally like dying to get this off my lips. All right, you guys. This claims to be an all-in-one mask for its ability to remove dead skin cells, excess sebum, sebum, and blackheads. Key ingredients include egg whites, vitamin C, love me some vitamin C, and AHA made from lemons, oranges, and sugar maple leaves. The egg white extract, also known as something else, the egg white, the egg white extract is a protein that tightens your pores and makes the skin extra smooth and soft. This one sounds like a really interesting mask, and I'm all about my pores being tightened and my face looking smoother. So I'm super excited to give this a go. In fact, I may have to try this one tonight. And if I like this one, I may be placing an order. Next up is one of the three step masks. I am not gonna lie, I'm not a huge fan of the steps where you have to do the extra work. Like I just wanna be able to toss my sheet mask on and call it a day. But this nonetheless has three different steps. It says step one is a calming toner, step two is soothing, and step three is relief. So this three step pack will provide relief to skin types that get easily irritated or tired. I do feel like my skin can be dull and tired really quickly. So it says so step one, use the calming toner after you cleanse your face to restore the pH levels back to normal. Step two, use the soothing step to give your, step two of the soothing step gives your tired skin some energy and then step three is to apply the relief cure mask onto your face and leave it on for 10 to 20 minutes your skin should let out a deep sigh as it is relieved of its irritants so i'm not gonna lie i don't have super super sensitive skin this one will probably sit in my collection for a little bit because again i just i don't like putting the extra work into these like step mask packs but Nonetheless, it will eventually get used and we'll see. And next up, we have this guy right here. This is the Air Packing Mint Wrap. Okay, this sounds like it's right up my alley. I love mint everything. Ice cream, candy, menthol-y things, gum, um, candles, mm, uh, lotion. I just, I love mint things. This is the Media Heal Air Packing Mint Wrap, and this mask has a unique name for a good reason. The cotton sheet itself is made of TPU film and mint pearl powder, which protects and blocks your skin from coming in contact with the polluted air and bad environment. This sheet mask and its essence contains 70% of something that has numerous amazing benefits such as moisturization, skin elasticity, and protection against UV light. Okay, good. Another moisturizing mask that I can add to my collection. Plus, it has mint in the name, so I've got to love it. I've got to love this one. I am super pumped to add this to my collection and give this guy a try. Next up, we have this guy. I love the sort of like Tiffany blue packaging on this. I, you probably can't even tell because my lights, I can't figure my lights out. Anyway, this is the Dew Peel Defense Mask Pour. So this says, who's ready to minimize some pores? Sign me up. The three key calming ingredients of hazel extract, something else extract, and tea tree extract will work to solve various skin concerns and give you clear and clean skin. This mask also uses a barrier defense system by using peptides, hydro hydrolyzed collagen, and something else to calm irritated skin and re restore liveliness. You may find this shocking, but I did somehow manage to graduate from college. <laughs> However, I still cannot sound spell or spell. So that's why some of this stuff I'm skipping over what it actually says. Uh, anyway, so this has tea tree oil in it, which I don't absolutely love. I don't have oily skin at all, so I don't know. Tea tree oil just isn't my favorite ingredient, but I love that it has collagen and peptides. So, you know, this guy might sit around for a little bit, but eventually he will get used as well. And then, then finally, this guy with the cute packaging, this is the One Step Original Clear Kit. It says, introducing to you guys our first ever sheet mask from the brand COSRX, a very popular up and coming brand in the world of affordable Korean skincare. So it says this three step kit, another three stepper, this three step kit will help to calm and prevent future pimples or breakouts. It says to first wash your face with the low pH good morning gel cleanser. This cleanser is formulated with purified botanical ingredients to soothe, refresh, and soften the skin. The second step is to use the pre soaked one step original clear pad to tone and exfoliate the skin this pad uses one percent 
of something and 80% of white willow bark. Great for clearing up the skin. And then the third step is to apply the Holy Moly Snail Mask and leave it on for 15 to 20 minutes. This sheet mask will lock in moisture and nourish the face with its snail mucin extract. Then gently pat all over the face for extra absorption. So again, the three step are just, these are not my thing. So this will probably sit in my collection for a while, especially because I don't have a ton of issues with like active breakouts or anything. So this doesn't necessarily sound like um, a mask that would be that interesting for me. Let me know in the comment box below, guys. Maybe I can set some of these sheet masks aside and include them in like a future giveaway of some sort. Not just sheet masks, obviously. I would include some other things. But let me know if you would at all be interested in that because some of these like simply just don't interest me that much. Anyway, that concludes this month's face story unboxing. As always, I'm excited to add seven more sheet masks to my collection. I'm not gonna lie, this was not my favorite month as far as like the ingredients and stuff or like the purpose of each mask was. Um, there are definitely some that like, mm, like I'm not super pumped to try, but like I'll still try them someday. Um, other months I've definitely been more excited about but nonetheless, I'm still gonna definitely stay subscribed to Face Story. Again, I really, really love the subscription. If you guys are at all interested in checking them out, I will leave a link in the comment box below. I believe it gets you 10% off your first month subscription. And if you guys are curious, I will also link uh, my previous month's unboxing in a playlist in the description box below in case you wanna check out any of the other months. But other than that, you guys, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, don't forget to do so before you go, and I will just see you in my next video. Bye.